You know, it's not every day that a girl from Cedar Grove finds herself sitting at the private desk of one of the best known coaches in America, a guy who used to play a little baseball. The Miles Masher. That's right, baby. Come on. It's a private tour of his home, which is covered in family pictures. There's a Bible given to him upon his arrival in Baton Rouge by a group of Shreveport pastors. And the walls are covered in LSU lore. Big moments, both then and maybe to come. He could be that guy. He could be that guy, there couldn't he? I think, I think he's got that. And, and in a big and, game, and this state here, he'd be the hero. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> but we are not alone. Oh, no. Although I'm almost sure we are the only unsigned LSU recruit left, the entire coaching staff and their wives have turned out. The place is covered in food. Mrs. Les Miles is kind and gracious, a real lady. Now keep in mind, Jamarie is not even here. He's hanging out with the other football players. This whole affair is for one person, Gwen Rasco. Of course, the replay of the Cotton Bowl game with Texas A&M attracts some attention too. I mean, how many times have you seen this game? Sure. <laughs> oh, God. I just told him I think the Tigers are going to win. <laughs> It's overwhelming the links LSU has gone to to show how much they want her boy. Talk to me, Mama. <laughs> You're at 50 yard line on Tiger Stadium. And my feet are frozen. Oh, oh my. I'm not used to wearing <laughs> Then it's back to the stadium. <laughs> What's it like on this field when there's 100,000 people out there screaming? It's crazy. It's so energetic. I can't even, I'm trying to act normal. I'm trying not to yell at me. Is that right? <laughs> a walk across an ice-cold Tiger Stadium and a final speech from Coach. I can tell you that when you pick a university, you pick a university that you count on to come through for you. In other words, when you go to school, the degree that you earn will get you the job that you deserve. That the Cox Communications, it prepares you to go to school and gives you a strategy on how to defeat and how to win academically. And uh, that when we graduate our players in three and a half years and most of our senior class walks before the bowl game, that that's just something that you inherit. That's a characteristic that becomes you. There's a unique challenge before our team. It's one that, uh, that our guys will understand. It just seems that uh, in 2003, a, a game of significance was played in New Orleans National Championship. There was an LSU team that played one there. In 2007, there was another uh, National Championship played for uh, in New Orleans. There was an LSU team there and one. And in 011, there's another national championship to be played in New Orleans. It's a great challenge to our team. You, uh, you have a great night. Enjoy yourself. And uh, go Tigers.